Yo, what's up guys, the Goblin, and today what I have for you guys is just some MW3 Moab gameplay, but today's video I'm going to be talking about Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, and I have some new leaked images for you guys, which I'll be talking about, and there's four images here, so this is a pretty important video. Uh, some of you guys may have seen these already, but I'll get into it, and hopefully you guys do enjoy this. So the first image I'll show up on the screen right now, all these images are from Game Informer and Charlie Intel, so they are reliable and, you know, legit images. Uh, the first one we have here is the hover bike, and basically the hover bike is something that most of us saw in the campaign trailer, if you were paying attention. They were driving across the bridge there with the hover bike and the hover bikes are basically futuristic sort of transfer Transportation methods which you will use in the campaign to get through Detroit a lot of the campaign is based in Detroit here And uh, you'll use them to go across bridges to drive around and basically shoot bad guys with the hover bike Which is really absolutely insane. I mean you saw the controlling of it a bit in the campaign trailer I think controlling these will be a lot of fun to drive around and um, you know It's gonna be definitely a lot of fun to drive these around will they be in multiplayer probably not but for campaign at least that would be really fun the second picture I have for you guys I'll show on screen right now is the 3d printer rifle so basically this is so, some more advanced technology they're trying to at sledgehammer basically predict the future because this game is going to be in 2054 they're going to give us information that is not yet out yet so we don't know what's going to be in 2054 that is in whatever 40 years from now exactly 40 years they don't really know so this is the 3d printer rifle and basically what it does is you load the bullets as, as a liquid matter and it converts them it makes the reload time a lot better and it shows you how many bullets you have left in the clip and stuff like that. It's basically just a futuristic rifle. That is something that we may see in the in the multiplayer as well. That's what I'm interested in. Is the multiplayer going to have all these futuristic weapons and stuff like that? Or are we going to see the you know the OG AK-47s, P90, you know stuff like that as well? Um, it'll be interesting to see. But this is a 3D printer rifle. It would be really cool to see in the multiplayer, and I would definitely love to see that in multiplayer. Next thing we have here, I'll show the picture on the screen, is the plasma powered rifle. This is sort of um, like a ray gun. I guess you could say, because the ray gun's kind of futuristic. The plasma-powered rifle, it shoots a little blue plasma balls at the enemies and can act can destroy them against foot soldiers. You saw something like this in the campaign, but it was a lot bigger. This one is basically, you know, as you can see in the picture, it's not that big. It'll be focused more for, you know, just regular soldiers and foot soldiers and taking them out and stuff like that. And the next thing we have here is obviously something that everyone has seen, which is the exoskeleton suit. Um, everyone's seen this. This is the new advanced technology that they're going to have for the wars in 2015 apparently and uh, it allows you to uh, makes you a lot stronger allows you to maneuver quicker and stuff like that and the exoskeleton suit is basically the main focus of this game they're trying to hype it up a lot whenever they leak a, a picture or something like that it always has the guy if, if the picture is focused on the gun it always has the guy in the exoskeleton suit carrying it because that's what they're trying to focus on with this game is you know putting the pressure on that exoskeleton suit and basically you know getting the hype up for there and I'm really excited E3 coming out soon. Those are just some leaked pictures I wanted to show you guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this quick video. If you guys could, please drop a like on it and subscribe to me if you're not already. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. And as always, subscribe for a cookie. I'm out. Peace.